Hey everybody, it's Parker. Today I'm going to walk through a really cool use case for the Pusher Channels product, a suite of real-time notification tools that integrate easily with all kinds of technologies like Node.js, Ruby, and Golang. I'm going to showcase a way of using a combination of the client and server-side libraries Pusher provides to create two-way real-time communication. The app I decided to build is called PusherBot, which is a chatbot from the future. Usually when I build software, it has to actually work. But for the sake of this tutorial, I decided to have a little fun and mock out an AI bot to have a conversation with. We're going to be able to perform all the communication between our client, a user, and the chatbot, PusherBot, just using development tools that Pusher provides and create React App, an open source starter kit for React.js. I'll be using Vim today, but the code provided with this tutorial should work just fine in any development environment that supports Node.js. Right here is the Pusher dashboard, where we can review our product usage such as daily concurrent connections and daily total messages. This is also where we can access our channels. The channels tool is designed to create real-time communication between software services through notification channels, which are the data pipelines between our services. These notification channels are organized into apps, and I'm going to make a new one to use for our chatbot. I'll call my new channels app PusherBot app and select React for our front end and Node.js for the back end. Once I've done that, I can see that there's client and server side tools that Pusher provides for us. As for client side libraries, I have JavaScript, iOS, Android, and React Native. And on the server side, we have just about everything you can think of. This is everything we need to build the communication layer between our users and our sentient AI. In the next tutorial, I will use the client side library to trigger events from our users so that PusherBot can receive messages in real time and respond.